guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a dramatic makeup look. Obviously with these brown lips and these lashes and just everything. I wanted to switch it up because on my channel I don't really have a lot of dramatic looks. And I, I'm not really the type to wear dark lips a lot. I always tend to stick with the nude lips, the pinks. But I wanted to get out of my comfort zone and try something new so I went for this sort of orange glitter smoky eye and these brown lips um yeah I hope you guys enjoy it and if you guys want to see how I got this look then please keep on watching alright to start off I'm gonna be priming my eyes with the NARS Pro Prime smudge proof eyeshadow base and I love this primer for my eyes I always use it so I'm gonna apply this and rub it in with my fingers and then for the palette, I'm going to be using the Morphe 35O palette. I'm going to be using a Sigma E35 tapered blending brush. And I'm just going to choose like a white beige shade and just apply that right onto my lid. Just to cover my veins. So it's basically going to work as a base for all the other eyeshadows that I'm going to apply. Then I'm going to be taking the Sigma E25 blending brush and with this light orange shade just going to apply it right onto the crease just as a transition shade. Then I'm going to be taking this light brown shade and I'm going to be applying this right onto my crease right on top of the light orange shade that I had applied and I'm just applying this just to create some dimension. So then I'm going to take the Morphe G17 and this is a really fluffy brush so it's really helpful in the blending process. Guys, blending is key, remember. So then I'm going to be taking this orangey shade and applying this onto my lid just to prep for the glitter eyeshadow that I'm going to be applying afterwards. Then with the Morphe E18 brush, I'm just going to be applying this brown shade into my crease and outer V of my eye. So now I'm going to be taking the orange glitter eyeshadow from the Morphe 35O palette, spraying some Fix Plus onto my brush and just applying that onto my lid. And then just blending all of the harsh edges from the glitter. As you can see, once you apply the glitter, it just creates like a harsh look and you just want to blend all of that out with a large blending brush. Then adding more of that brown shade just because I felt like I lost some of it while blending. Primer, I'm going to be using the Nivea Men Sensitive Cooling Pulse Shave Balm. And taking the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Cushion Foundation and applying it with the Morphe M439 Buffing Brush. For concealer, I'm going to be using the LA Girl Pro Conceal. Just applying that under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, on my chin, on my cupid's bow, on my forehead, and also below my contour. To blend the concealer, I'm going to be using the Real Techniques Sculpting Brush. <laughs> then 
Then to cream contour, I'm gonna be using the NYX Incredible Waterproof Concealer in the shade Nutmeg. <laughs> Blend it out with the Morphe M436 Dual Fiber Brush. baking with the Laura Mercier loose setting powder right under my eyes and just the places where I apply concealer. Also, I did my eyebrows off camera while I was baking, so I didn't just take my bake off right away. So now I'm taking this powder blush in bronze from Mellow Cosmetics that I got in my Ipsy bag, and I'm just applying that right on my cheekbones. <laughs> Now I'm just contouring with the same blush that I applied on my cheekbones. I'm contouring my nose with that and using the G17 brush. Then for my lower lash line, I'm going to be applying this light orange shade. And then after that, I'm going to be applying the other orange shade that I had used on my lid. Then for lashes, I'm going to be using the Coco Goddess Lashes and just applying some dual glue and then applying it with some tweezers onto my lash line. Then for mascara, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Telescopic in Carbon Black. Then to apply my highlight, I'm going to be using the Morphe M501 and I'm going to be using the Jarred Cosmetics Highlighter in Marilyn. I'm also going to be applying the highlight on my brow bone and in my tear duct. Then for my lipstick, I'm going to be using the Melania Moore Matte Lip Cream in the shade Covet. tutorial guys i hope you all enjoyed it please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and please comment down video suggestions please 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 i love to know what you guys want to see i love interacting with you guys it means the world to me so thank you guys so so much for all the support i love you guys also follow my social media instagram is natalie ruiz 16 twitter is hello happiness 3ls snapchat is hello happiness with three l's i'm more active on instagram and snapchat so um try to follow me on there i think right now i have 2500 subscribers like it's kind of crazy that i have that many subscribers like wow i'm so so blessed and thankful to have each and every single one of you watching my videos 
just means so, so much to me. So thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I love you all. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. These lashes are gorgeous, but they feel like you have it feels like you have bats on your eyes.